Hey, Sacred Sea Moline. Uh, I wanted to jump on and do a little video blurb here about the announcement that Abby made on Sunday morning about this Covenant members meeting that's coming up on January 23rd. It's going to follow the gathering right away. We'll provide a little lunch so you can go right downstairs, get going, um, even feed the kids. We'll get some stuff lined up for them too, and then have child care um, so that we can sit down for our annual Covenant members meeting. We try to do this once a year. We got a little out of habit uh, last year with COVID, but we're back at it. Um, and this is such an, an important meeting because really that's all that we have this whole year as far as um, what's on the schedule, unless there's some sort of churchwide emergency or something along those lines. It's really this one time a year that we get all of the covenant members together um, and, and we do a couple of really important things that I want you to be there for in the room, um, if at all possible. So put it on your calendars, make sure you get up in the morning, go to church, right? Got to do that. You've made a covenant to do that. So um, and then join us for this meeting and make arrangements if you need to be there or to, to make sure that you can be there. Um, we're covering a few important things. First, um, we I, I want to give a little bit of a, a um, basically like a state of a church state of the church uh, address. Uh, talk about the the evidences of grace and really do a good job of uh, and, and have your input here on on capturing some of the things that we've seen really got God really at work over the last year and I mean, even go back. Uh, to the last time that we met. Um, and then I want to be able to step into, again, looking forward to this year and giving a little bit more vision, what I feel the Lord has put on the horizon for us as covenant members, um, things that we're thinking through, things that our church can grow in that I feel like beyond this feast to flourish thing that we're doing, that, that just diving deeper into our Bibles, things that are going to kind of go and uh, along with that, be paired up with that, that I, I want to bring us into, give you an update um, on where the men are at in the elder development process, give you an update where we are financially. Um, and then we're also going to sit down um, and and recovenant to the church, to one another um, as members, as the body. Um, and part of that is going to be including financial updates to help us project our budget for the coming year and what we can do as far as what uh, ministry here at Sacred City Moline and into churches that we are helping to plant and uh, other churches and, and ministries and mission opportunities as the Lord brings along. So we want to be able to project our budget um, and, and for you and to have you pledge to your tithes and offerings. Um, it's been a while since we've updated those, and the Lord's been gracious to to many of us. Um, new jobs, uh, new new seasons of life that have opened up some some fr financial freedom, and so. Um, to, to reevaluate re we, where we are with our, our tithes and offerings and to uh, commit anew. Um, so that's a piece of it. So you may need to uh, think ahead about that. Sit down with your spouse, talk about where you're at budget-wise, um, and if, and if uh, there, there's a way to step forward in generosity in that regard or, or just uh, an evaluation of that in general. So we're going to do that, do a little homework ahead of time um, coming up for that. And share a little bit about our hopes for the coming year. And so I, I really am excited, very optimistic about this year. I want to spend this time with you and just rejoice and get excited together. And so please make every effort uh, to be there. Uh, mark it on the calendars right now. Uh, if you got a, I don't know, I realize that some people are going to be out of town. Let me know if you are so I can get you up to speed on this. But for the most part, please, can you just be here and save me 12 extra meetings? I'd really appreciate that. Um, and it's just good to be all, all together. So um, the 23rd, January 23rd, immediately after the gathering, have a light lunch that'll be served. Um, we'll start our meeting and we'll go through some of those meeting items um, and spend a little bit of time in prayer together as as the church and, and just in, in, invite the Lord to have his way with us. So please, please, please get that on the calendar. It's a very important meeting. I can't stress that enough. Very important meeting. One time a year. All right. One time a year. Very important meeting. Get it on the calendar. I'll see you there January 23rd for our covenant members meeting. Love you guys. Uh, I'll see you soon.